Hi everyone, I'm Dan from Dan Aesthetics here in Ottawa. Today I'm going to be going over how we can reverse that saddened expression we sometimes develop as we mature. I'll go over some of the causes. I'll also go over some thought process with regards to my rationale. Stay tuned. Should be good. So let's get into it. The corners of our mouth usually end up having this natural upturn from birth all the way till about 15. Then from 15 to about 25 can neutralize. After 25, depending on genetics and family history, it can either stay neutral or it can depress slightly or it can depress dramatically. Now, why does that happen? Well, there are multiple factors, but the main reason is a discordance between your muscle strength and your soft tissue tensile. Now, let's look at your soft tissue. Basically, when we're talking about that, we're looking at elastin and collagen in your skin. These things naturally start depleting over time. So instead of having this kind of even tug of war between the two of them, the depletion of the skin, elastin and collagen end up taking the muscle fibers to an exaggerated level of strength and they start doing all the work. Now, we're talking about this muscle here, this depressor angular orus here, and that starts pulling down because we're losing volume here. What can we do to fix it? Well, we need to A, relax that muscle, and B, potentially restore some volume here. If you're looking for something that has more efficacy, a little bit more of a natural result, and longer lasting, then absolutely you should be thinking filler. You can use filler and Botox at the same time, just be careful, you don't want to have a dramatic reverse and cause that joker effect. Now. Here is Sarah, Sarah is our model, and basically this is our depressor angular oris or DAO. This muscle here is taking over, so there's a discordance, and this is now pulling down. So what can we do in order to help relax that muscle? We can restore the volume that was lost here with hyaluronic acid filler. You know, we can do a variation of techniques, but basically a lot of people do like a crossing here and here. Some people just provide a little volume right here, and then some people will, you know, volumize the whole marionette zone and you're going to get an equal result. The reason why is because you're just providing some structure there. The muscle can now relax. It's not pulling down any longer and now it goes back to its neutral position. And if you still feel you need a little extra, then then you can go ahead and give that Botox and it can correct it a little bit more. Now it's important to note that the muscles in our face do talk to each other. So if I'm going to relax one of our depressor muscles, such as the DAO, then one of my levator muscles, which upturns the corner of the mouth, such as the zygomaticus minor and major, will probably compensate and that'll assist us in pulling up the corner of the mouth as well. Now understanding that, what else can we do in order to, you know, rise the corner of the mouth? Well, we have a rosorius muscle that pulls over here. We have a zygomaticus major muscle that comes up this way and we also have a zygomaticus minor muscle that kind of runs up this way actually. So what happens is that sometimes when we do cheeks we actually will do an injection over here and what will happen is it's now relaxing this muscle and then guess what the zygomaticus minor muscle actually starts taking over to help with the slack and you can also get a little bit of a lifting of the corner of the mouth. Now, I personally wouldn't go ahead and start doing cheeks in order to, to lift the corner of the mouth, but don't be surprised if you end up doing cheeks that they end up getting a little bit of an upturn. It's just getting a better understanding of what's going on with the, the facial dynamics and having a, a better understanding of what's going on with uh, the muscles and the skin. So that is it for me today. I appreciate you being here. I'm producing these videos weekly. If you enjoy what you see, do me a favor, comment and subscribe. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Until then, take care.